Hello and good day. Today we have this uh, Bluetooth module that uh, we're going to connect to the Pixhawk. First up, we have to connect it to the FTDI adapter, and we have to connect the ground, the plus, the plus 3.3 volts, and the TX and RX. Obviously, you connect the TX to the RX and the RX to the TX and the ground to the ground and the VCC to the plus this is not a 5 volt module actually it's 3.3 so you have to connect it to the 3.3 to the VCC so what I've done here is I used the, this cable it has a male and a female uh, lead and uh, I've connected the FTDI to the Bluetooth adapter. Now we have to connect it to the PC using a standard USB mini cable. Before powering up the Bluetooth module and the FTDI adapter, we have to press the button on the Bluetooth adapter. So it's kind of tricky now, but I have to hold it, hold the button, and then connect the USB to the computer. And then I let go, and you're gonna see it's gonna flash slowly. Now, after connecting the Bluetooth module to the PC, you have to download Arduino. Now, uh, if you don't already have it, you have to go and download it, and then afterwards you're gonna be in this window here. So you press Tools, you select the board to be Arduino Nano, and then you select your COM port. You have to find out which is your COM port. Mine is 7. You can do this in the device manager page. So, afterwards you select the serial monitor. Now, you have to select this option and this baud so you can connect to the Bluetooth module. Also, you have to use the you have to use caps lock in order to send the commands provided here. So, it says type AT and select OK. You have to copy and paste this and now you're done. You have set you have successfully set up the baud rate for the mission planner to work with the Pixhawk. All you have to do now is unplug the board and use the special cable provided to connect the Pixhawk and Mission Plan. You're gonna need to build this cable to connect the Bluetooth module to the to the Pixhawk. Now <clears throat> you have to connect the TX to the RX, the RX to the TX, the ground and the VCC. So uh, you plug in this. And you got the Pixhawk, which you have to connect it to the telemetry one. Now we're gonna go to the PC, we're gonna power it up. First up, you have to set up the Bluetooth module to connect to the PC. I'm using a desktop computer that has a Bluetooth dongle. You go on and add a Bluetooth device. You select it, it's going to ask for a password. So it's one, two, three, four. It's connected and ready to go. I already know that my COM port for the Bluetooth dongle that I use on my PC is COM port 8, and it has to, it has to be connected to 57,600 bouts to work. And you're done. 